see it just got unlocked. And what you're going to want to do is come down here to voicemail. Now, the reason is because we have it unlocked, it doesn't mean that you have all the information to port it over to your new provider. So I'm using Xfinity, and they require an account number and also the port out pin. With a traditional phone number, like a Verizon or Sprint, they're going to give you all this information. With Google Voice, the account number is the phone number. Um, so for me, I know you can't see it, but this is the account number. And then the pin is the same pin that you use to unlock your voicemail. So right now, Google Voice doesn't have a pin. So I'm going to create a pin for it right here. So I'm going to say call to listen. And by clicking call to listen, it's going to ask for a pin. So make up a pin and save it. And now we now have a pin for our voicemail. And once again, this is going to be the pin that we need to transfer this phone number over to your carrier. So the account number is the phone number. The account pin is now the voicemail pin. I hope this works for you guys. Thanks for watching.